Hello everybody and welcome back to Insane Brit Gaming. I'm the Insane Brit. Hit that uh, subscribe button or notification bell to get all the notifications. Um, now, uh, a couple of updates before we even get started into this. Um, my apologies for the lack of content on Friday. I changed my internet service provider and it took another 24 hours to get um, to get back online kind of thing. Um, so yeah. So let's dive right into it. So first and foremost, great result at Tottenham. Chelsea's um, Chelsea beating Tottenham uh, 2-1. VAR at its BS again, doing whack crap. Uh, inconsistency, they made a mistake, they admitted to it, whatever. Um, but enough of uh, that. This is a massive game. Uh, this, is, this is the formation we played in a previous game. Giroud, I did think, would start up top because Frank Lampard said on form those players will get to play. Hence the uh, fact that Willy Caballero played, etc. etc. Conceding a goal due to a uh, deflection. Uh, Giroud may start up top, but I know Tammy Abraham did come on uh, off the bench. So I'm going to put Giroud on anyway at the start for experience. Big World Cup winner, whatever, with France. But it may be Abraham at the end of the day. Um... Barkley played and he played well, um, no doubt about it. But in this formation, I, but I cannot see the likes of William being left off. I just cannot see him not playing versus Bayern Munich. That would be crazy. Uh, so I am going to leave him on with Barkley on the bench. So uh, we have us uh, injuries still. <clears throat> Christian is back in the squad uh, with that mask. He went to Italy. This was the bench for uh, the game as well, minus Barkley. Uh, Gilmore was on the bench as well. He's moved into the first team squad, etc., etc. Uh, I'm not too sure about all these players. Plus, it may not be back. Hudson Adoy, I'm not sure about. Uh, Kante, unsure about, whatever. So, we're just going to leave all these players off who we know are currently injured. And we're going to dive right on into the match. So, yeah, guys, my apologies for the lack of content but uh i'll do an update video uh coming soon in the next week or whatever about what what's been going on with the channel and stuff like that so it is by munich it's a big heavyweight um in the footballing world um whew. i want to win but with the amount of power and strength this team has and in depth with uh kingsley coman uh just to name like one of them thomas muller Lewandowski, it's gonna be a hell of a battle it is at Stamford Bridge. It is the last of the 16. Last 16, sorry. Here is the Chelsea line. Number 13, Willy Caballero. Number 28, Azpilicueta. So I've obviously turned off uh, commentary and stuff and all music. But yeah, so uh, Ch Chelsea uh, controlled the w uh, game well at Tottenham. My commentary in the last game wasn't that great. Harry Kane, I didn't know, was injured and one or two others. But again, it's up to FIFA to make those distinctions. Who plays when and what, so... Um, saying I don't touch the opposition team, so it is what it is. But I wasn't very happy with my commentary in the previous match, I admit that. Number 18, Olivier Giroud. But yeah, this is absolutely massive. Okay, it seems to have gone blank. Okay, here we go. So Neuer in goal, one of the top goalkeepers in the world, wanted to buy him uh, years ago before he went to buy him. Alaba's there as well. He's playing centre-back, I believe. But we look so strong against Tottenham. Alright, so Willy Caballero in goal. Zuma on the bench, Loftus-Cheek. Alonso, Kavakovic, Jorginho in the front. Mount William up top. With uh, Giroud leading the attack. Now, of course, I don't know why Munich players, so I'm going to get some names wrong. So, Neuer in goal. I'll call, oh, Coleman's on the bench, long Coutinho. Davis, Alaba, Boating, and Pavard. Okay, at the back four. Thiago, Goretzka, and Kimmich in the midfield. Gnabry, Lewandowski, and Muller. Um, Gnabry, I believe that's how you say his name, is um, former Arsenal. And I think they, some big club wanted to buy him the other day, or they were talking about it. Maybe it was Juventus or someone like that. So let's step out of the game and let uh, Chelsea versus Bayern Munich commence. So here we go. Chelsea kick it off. Home field advantage to Chelsea. Will you? Don't know if we'll be playing this same formation as we did against Tottenham. Uh, you may switch it back to the original 4 3 3. James now blocked off by Ganabi, playing left back at this point, bursting forward. No one challenging him. Kimmich now. 
running from the midfield. Nice little back heel. Plays a nice little one two. They couldn't cover it. Oh, and Lewandowski going into the centre now. James. Kovacic. Could pick it into the left-hand side. Tons of space in the midfield. Oh, it's a brilliant movement there from Mount, I believe that is. Yes, it is. Should have done more with it. Back heel now. Support from Alonso. He scored a... Or nearly scored... Uh, he scored a good goal. And then he nearly scored that free kick. Oh, Jorginho doing defensive work. Unlucky Lewandowski just possessed him. Thiago. Former Barcelona player. Kimmich now. Threading it through to Thiago. Threading it through on this left-hand side. Konami! Oh, with a good left foot. Just went wide. The keeper had it covered. So this is interesting. I've got to be honest with my perspective. Do I expect Chelsea to win the Champions League this year? No. But let's go as far as we can. And uh, who knows? We've got nothing to lose. So might go even go all the way. The pressure ain't on us. At least I don't believe it is. Not expected with these young kids kind of thing. So, but God knows what we can pull out the bag. Never know. Kovacic. He played really well in the previous game as well. Oh, what a ball. It's brilliant. It's Reese James on his right-hand side. Tons of space for him to move around. Gets across in. William with the header. Attempted header. Blocked off. Chelsea still have possession. James. William. Puts a ball into the box. Giroud. Oh, goes up for it. Cleared. Chelsea still in possession. Jorginho. Bayern trying to get on the ball. Struggling. Giroud holding up play rather well. James once more. Boating with the clearance this time. So it was a poor game uh, simulation last week when Kane scored a crappy header and it ended 1-0 early on in the match. So, weren't great. Weren't very entertaining overall. Christensen. This seems to be a better match. And with this formation, seems to be doing quite well. Giroud. William now. Trying to thread it through. Davis blocks off. Never heard of this random player called Davis who plays for Bayern Munich before in my life. Kimmich. Flip to the right-hand side now. Pavon. Or Pavard, sorry. Plays it to Muller. Muller, very experienced striker. Puts it in. Left-hand side, Kanabi. Seems to be their star player at this point. Tries to keep it on. 17 minutes gone. Muller. Fiaga. Grotetska. If I got that pronunciation wrong, my apologies. If I've only seen it once or twice. Can't remember all these names. Davis now. Lewandowski. Back to Davis. Back to Lewandowski now. Kanabi. Blocked off by Chelsea. William now. Kovacovic plays it into the... Giroud. Into the centre. Chelsea knocking the ball around quite comfortably. Blocked off his time. Muller now trying to find space. Running it through to Fiago. Chelsea looks so solid there. In numbers. Look at that. Getting back. Then coming forward. Tons of time and space in the ball. Should use their pace uh, to break away. It's a big ball into the box. And it's back to the goalkeeper. Nuya now threading it out. Uh, passing it out, sorry. And it's gone. Seems like uh, Bayern don't know what to do with it at this point. Mount. Bayern back in possession now. Boating. Kimmich. The balls they're knocking around this pitch is brilliant. Like amazing passes. Gnabry with an early cross. And it's clear too easy. Ooh. There was a... Uh, a midfielder coming in to, uh, I think that was Christensen who cleared it, to close him down. Didn't like that. No mucking around with it at the back, please. That's for the And there's a not very good clearance, I've got to say. Still nil-nil here at 28 minutes gone. Lewandowski. Running it through to Gnabry. Viago. Kimmich. Lewandowski. 
Ooh, brilliant shot. Oh, got hard hit. Blocked off by, uh, I think that was Alonso. Oh, it's put, given away by Christensen now. Lewandowski. Gnabry. Throws it back. Oh, blocked off by the defender, I think it was. Maybe a corner. What have I got that wrong? No, it was that, actually. Fiago. Kimmich. Back to Fiago now. Inside the box. Puts it across. Goal! And 1-0. Oh, I'm disappointed in that. Chelsea kept him off for the longest period of a long time. And uh, not a very good goal. Scrappy. I've got to say. Not thrilled with that. Fiago, good movement. Plays it across goal. He beats... Uh, Christensen and the goalkeeper, ugh, look, damn, he was on it, man, he was on it, should have done it better, so Lewandowski and Bayern Munich have broken the deadlock, at 32 minutes gone, 1-0 to Bayern, Goal disappointing, Bayern especially how well we controlled the game, I felt we've had uh, decent possession, some good football, maybe not enough chances, William now, trying to take him on, Davis, blocked off, blocks him off, Viago, and Gnabry once more, Jorginho trying to get back, Gnabry still in possession, gives it to Viago, nice little back heel, Kovacic this time with the clearance, Lewandowski, Kimmich, Lewandowski once more with a shot blocked off, or it might have been a pass, all from Christensen's mistake I believe that was, originally, Kortetska, Pavard, Blocked off by the package now. Chelsea in possession once more. Jorginho. Still on it. Alonso. Mount. Alonso get into a decent position like he did in the previous game. Nice little back heel, cross into the box, it's Giroud, blocked off by the defender, causes a header, and that's what we haven't done enough of, to be honest with you, not enough crosses into the box, uh, causing a panic amongst the defenders, It's uh, I think it's the first corner for Chelsea, not very good, that tells the story in itself, in what, 43 minutes gone, playing it short, it looks like it anyway, yes it is, William, inside the box now, I'll give a six yard box, Kovacic, and it's lost, Pavel with the clearance, Edge of a six yard box, Alonso. Chelsea still have possession. Jorginho. Giroud with a little flick and then a turn and then a shot, but it had no venom on it. It wasn't even on target. I have a feeling Abraham will be coming on. He'll be a bit more lively up top. A bit more running around, I don't know. Three minutes added. Muller, Lewandowski, already got played pretty well, Grotewski now, back to Lewandowski, who scored the only goal of the game thus far, got to close him down, he's going to bypass your defenders, throws it through, oh, and tried to pass it past Calabrero there, blocked off, easy save, I think that was Muller, it was offside anyway, it was a late call. And that is the end of the first half. Chelsea played well, dominated possession, but they've lost the goal. They're a goal down. Bayern Munich weren't exactly second best all throughout that game, especially in the latter stages. It'll be interesting to see what substitutions are made, especially from Chelsea's point of view. How to improve our team. I think Abraham will come on for a bit of movement up top. Grotesca now. Bayern have got so many on the bench as well. It's unreal to change it any way they want to. I mean, it's unreal. Gnabry. 
on this left hand side now trying to give it to Davis blocked off by James Caballero clear it properly mate just a poor clearance as well given away Pavard Lewandowski now puts it into Gortetska now inside the box what can he do with it puts it across to Muller takes a strike right at the keeper ooh didn't like the fact he got a shot off even but there you go Kovacic keepers ain't been tested an awful lot especially Bynes one Nuya Alonso now on this left hand side now gets a big cross in Giroud and it's plucked out the air by Nuya nothing really no pressure on the ball 52 minutes gone Muller by Munich as you were for the uh, the second half plays nice little one two Lewandowski nice little back heel Viago now blocked off by Christensen Chelsea with the clearance slow pace build up of football there but didn't come to nothing Bind still in possession Gnabry Kimmich Muller back to Kimmich now Lewandowski running it through to Gnabry now and it's blocked off by James I think that's a corner to Bayern Munich the substitution being made, Kingsley Coman is coming on for Gnabry. Coman's a good player, man. I would I would have bought him years ago as well. You think he was originally at Juventus? He went to a French club or whatever. He's been all over the place. And he's still only 25, 24, 25 years of age. It's crazy. And he's won a lot of silverware, I believe. I'm, I'm, I believe he's got like 15 things. I don't know. I'm not too sure. But he's been all over the, all over the place. Muller. Tetsuka now. Back to Muller. With a cross, punched by uh, Caballero. Davis, Viago. Common hasn't even touched the ball just yet. Offside. And I think that's a substitution for Chelsea this time. Pedro is on for James on this right hand side. He's playing a further advanced role, so maybe when they want more attacking. Muller of experienced veteran of uh, European football and by uh, Barcelona player obviously Muller running it through to Lewandowski back to Muller left foot but Caballero saw it coming just an easy catch Giroud holding up play like I said the formation may change obviously in um, in real life it may play a 4-3-3 to compete I don't know William now trying to front through to Giroud, blocked off by Bayern. Giroud back in possession, loses out once more to Fiago. Kimmich now to Muller. Riega with a challenge. Still able to keep the ball. Pavard. Grotesca now just teasing him. Fiago. Only 1 0 up here, Bayern. Looking very comfortable on the ball. Nice little bit of skill there from Coleman. Puts it into the box. Lewandowski with a header and a great save from Caballero. My God, they can turn it around, Bayern. They put the ball in the box and got on the end of it. Grotesca now. Picking up the pace by Munich. I mean, yeah, by Munich of this game. Puts another cross in. Christensen with a blocked off header. And this time, I think that was Jorginho with a panic clearance. They got rid of it. Bayern just turning it on now. Up in the, uh, the quality of what they're doing. They got the ability. Chelsea not really closing them down uh, at all now. This is not good. They've got too much time and space on the ball. Muller. Plays it into the centre. Lewandowski now. Back to Kimmich now. Bypasses man. Lewandowski tries to take a shot. Christensen this time with the block. Alonso in possession. Chelsea have got to do a lot more with this. It's not good. 72 minutes gone. Mount now coming forward. Needs support. Back heel to Giroud. Another little back heel. Kovacic now. Chelsea looking dangerous until Alaba challenges and breaks it up. Chelsea haven't had a lot going forward in the second half at all. If anything, it's been poor. Really poor. They need to make that substitution get um, Abraham on there. I don't know. They need something. Something different up top. Pavard. Bayern just so strong holding this... Uh, 
substitution for holding decent possession and that is uh, Coutinho coming on for I didn't see that Cortezka I think that is so another creative player yeah it is Cortezka ain't done too badly Coutinho coming on Chelsea need to liven up and make a sub there's only 10 minutes left 10-12 minutes or whatever Viago. Bayern Munich had dominated possession throughout the second half dominated the play dom and had the better opportunities Chelsea looked very defensive very lacklustre going forward if anything it's been really poor in this uh, second half Alonso Jorginho Chelsea coming forward now William Spreading it through to Pedro, and that's blocked off. Ugh. Oh, not had enough of anything in the second half. Chelsea need to do something to break it. <clears throat> I mean, to get that uh, goal, to uh, make it a uh, 1-1 at least. To snatch your point here. Actually, no, it's the last 16, isn't it? It would be um, away goals or whatever. And now Abraham comes on for Giroud. I think a little bit too little, too late for me. Five minutes to go. Disappointing, but whatever. Mount. It's in a cross. Abraham trying to take a shot. And uh, boating now. I think it's what, a Chelsea's second corner of the game. That tells the story in itself. Not very good. Can they pull Sank out of the hat? Will Rudiego or Christensen get Sank on the end of it? Will they play it short? Yes, they do. William. Put a ball in the box, mate, please. Do something different. Rudiega not on the end of it. And they try to break away. Chelsea still in possession now. William. Pedro. Dinks it over the top on his left-hand side. Alonso now takes it down. Puts the ball in the box. Oh, and there's a header there. I'm not too sure that was off Abraham or was it Alaba? It may be another corner to Chelsea. If so, that would be the third of the game. It is. They're going to... Oh, Chelsea making a sub. Barkley's on for Jorginho. Wow. A bit more physical in the midfield. Maybe that's what they feel they need. 87 minutes gone. Chelsea take the corner. Cleared comfortably. Chelsea's still in possession now. Christensen. Barkley now. Running it through. No one's gotten any end of it. Ah. Oh. Barkley competing. Got to be a bit more physical against Bayern, I suppose. In that midfield. Yeah, a tough midfield. Bayern coming forward. Muller. Coutinho now inside the box. Challenged by Alonso. Goes down. Coutinho still in possession now. Puts across in the box. Lewandowski couldn't get the accuracy on the header. And uh, it's gone wide. I think that's going to be about it for uh, this week's match. I can't see him doing anything more after that. The whistle will just go. Four, uh, 20 seconds left. And that is the end of this week's simulation. Chelsea dominated the possession in the first uh, half. Bayern Munich held them off. Came really strong on the second half. Disappointed to have lost 1-0 here. Um, so they have the away goal um, in Lewandowski. It was a scrappy goal that they scored. Uh, nonetheless, in terms of man of the match, I could give it to Lewandowski, uh, but Thiago, for me, uh, was uh, key to everything as well. Uh, so I might give it to Thiago. He, was, he played really well in this match. Uh, as for Chelsea, I don't know where I even stand about who did what there. Uh, it was just to and fro. Not really outshone anyone for Chelsea, I felt, personally. Um, I'm hoping, I mean, I don't know. I'm hoping that we're going to have some people back. Maybe Kante in theory. I don't know. Or a doy, someone. I don't know. I just want someone back. Well, at least hopefully maybe we uh, perform a lot better on the day. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this week's simulation. Uh, we've lost 1-0 again, um, according to this. Uh, in real life, we beat Tottenham 2-1. Hopefully it's a uh, obviously a different uh, situation in its entirety. 
um, on the night. We win. We beat Bayern three 0 comfortably. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know. Uh, anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this week's simulation. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Links will be in the description below. If you want to donate to me via PayPal, buy some merchandise. It's up to you. Please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. And uh, I'll let you enjoy these uh, replays and uh, keep the blue flag flying high. Thanks so much for watching. Thank <laughs> you.